Welcome everyone back to iRacing here at Lime Rock Park uh, in the GR86. I apologize for the lack of uploads lately. Uh, I, I did do Watkins Glen, but it was just a train wreck and not even worth uploading. I couldn't even get a clean enough race to do it. I spent like 10 minutes in the pits. Um, Bristol, I'll be honest, I, just, I didn't buy the track. I just didn't really have the money to get it this past week. And our, our short track program isn't great, so it seemed like a good one to kind of skip. Uh, but I do plan on doing Kansas this week. But I was sitting there and I was thinking, man, I've been getting itched to go back and do some road back to my old Gran Turismo roots with some sports car racing. Uh, so we're hopping into the GR86 here at Lime Rock Park. Uh, for those of you that don't know, fun fact, I do have a GR86 in real life. My daily driver car. Um, although, of course, this is very much different being the uh, GR Cup car. Uh, a little bit. It's a little bit different. Um, but here we are, so, see how we do, it's now not, we're not terribly great, and we haven't done enough road yet to really, you know, be good at it. I know this track a little bit, I did it once in the, uh, 1600s, um, I think that's the first time I've done it in the GR86, but let's go ahead and qualify, and see how we do. Wasn't terribly terrible in practice. All it was like the one or two. Okay, Ryan, we've got two laps. Let's get this done. I guess a one o three one. That was my best. Optimal was a one o two eight. My worst section is up at the top of the hill. So smooth out lap here. Try to get some heat in the tires, but not wear them out. Temperature is decreasing. It's now 68 Fahrenheit. Chill, dude. This is my worst spot. I gotta take this a little deep and then line it up. That's the best way for me to do it right there. Can't hit that first apex. I was able to get it once really good, but it came through there all pretty cleanly. Alright, here we go. Hey, chill. Kind of miss that first apex again. So we hit this one clean. Like I said, I'm sure I can do this so much better. Just need to find my line through here. That wasn't great. Way too slow. Again, track I don't have a lot, ton of experience on. Which is all part of it, you know, you gotta get to know these tracks before you can really get them dialed in. Oh, jeez. Uh, try to get on the gas too soon. The leader's just done a 103.18. Alright, it's gonna be a second. The leader has just done a 102.65. The leader has just done a 101.92. B6. Sector 3 is 2.8 seconds off the pace. Let's not screw this up over here. We're gonna take it in slow, line this up, not get on the gas too soon. Two is 0.5 off the there pace. That's better. A little better. And then we can take this flat out. Fastest lap for Andreas, 101.77. Last lap was a 103.75. Great. Okay. 
What's our car number? I didn't even really look. We're car number 14. One, two. So we got a lot of guys starting from the back that want to do last to first, it looks like. Then one, two, three cars are all not participating. Which means they're going to be aggressively driving to the front. So one, four, three, two. All these guys not putting in qualifying times. Because they want to make passes. So we're just going to have to... Yeah, we got some work to do on our road program. <laughs> I thought since our driver rating was so low, we might uh, find a groove with some people more our speed. But oh well, this is how we learn. We got to do races. I've only done a handful of these in this car. Most of my road I rating and safety stuff has come from. NASCAR road races where it counts on this license. So that's where most of my experiences come from in here. Like the Chicago Street Race, uh, Walton's Glen, all those count on your road license. So, or your sports car license, I should say. All right, so we're going to be right at the back of the field with uh, the fast guys that are going to be coming up through. We did have one person qualify worse than us. So, we just got to be consistent. Our goal will be consistency. Some of these guys might be able to put in a fast lap, but are going to take each other out or whatever. Just not getting fights with people. We're not to the point yet where we can be making passes and stuff. We just need to find our groove, pick our battles, stay alive. It's going to be the goal. Take a nice little Sunday drive. That'll be the name of this video. Sunday drive. As I watch my fantasy team go down in flames. Because Jalen Hurts is a bum this week. Kind of a late decision to stream this. Sorry, I don't have the camera set up. Uh, like I've, you've heard me say before, it's a lot of work. I have to record it on a separate, on my laptop separately and then splice it all in and my laptop is dead, so that's why we got to go with this. But I do have my McLaren GT3 wheel on the rig right now. Went with that guy. Come on, guys, just time out if you're not going to go. Wait on all these people that aren't going to ever qualify. So hit the button. So what was our best time at 103.8? Or no, 102.8 was our optimal. So our optimal time is right on 5th. Our best time in practice, I think, is right around here. Like 6th or 7th. So we'll see. Of course, again, I'm not counting all these guys that didn't qualify. I'm assuming they're quick. A lot of times... <laughs> session p11 if it's anything like it was in gran turismo the dudes that do last to first they may be quick but they suck at passing so they just end up like getting upset if you don't let them buy so probably gonna end up letting a lot of those guys buy and hopefully they uh spin out people ahead of us or something because they're angry we'll see seconds. I'm pretty sure this isn't a standing start.
It is kind of cool though, seeing my air vent right there and the little headpiece all reminds me of my 60 car. 60 seconds. The track temperature's decreasing. It's now 68 Fahrenheit. Good to know. Seconds. What is everybody doing, man? They don't want to qualify. They don't want to grid. Ten seconds. Ryan, you should do okay here. We're aiming to finish in the top. 12. We've got cold tires. We need to get some heat into them. There we go. Okay, rolling starts. Follow car Nothing. number 11 in the right column. I got a little nervous there because I haven't really done too many standing starts. It's been a while since I've done one. Race car speed is 47 miles per hour. They were going. Catch up to car number 11. That would be rolling off a little slower than that. Fun fact that uh, trucks will be racing at Lime Rock next season. That'll be exciting. Can you imagine doing this in a truck? Woo. Catch up to car number 11. Heads up, get ready. Go, nail it. Left side. Still there. Hold your line. Clear left. Hopefully we can get spread out before those top cars start coming up through the field would be nice. Okay, Ryan. The next car is Tebow. Car number 11. D license. <laughs> nice start, mate. Well done. Left. Clear left. Got somebody hitting on me. P9. Yep, that's what that guy gets, being dumb. That's what, hap that's what happens when those guys are faster and they want to play last to first. You put yourself in that position. That guy was clearly off the track. I don't know why. I mean, I get he shouldn't have rejoined, but you got to at least be aware that people are going to be stupid sometimes.
Car left. Hold your line. Clear left. Here comes some of those fast drivers. On your left. Like I said, not going to fight them. Hold your line. Clear left. The leader has just done a See if I can't follow him through. Tenth position. Sector 1 is 0.7 off the pace. You're a second off the pace in Sector 2. Sector 3 is 1.3 off the pace. Let's see if these fast guys get frustrated and take some people out in front of us. is Lucas, car number a five, D license. We're gonna get frustrated with that guy and we'll see if they the how they handle it. Holmes behind is now 0.6. At least we're kind of running with some cars for a little bit. We didn't just get left out. That's a new fastest lap for Andreas. 101.92. I do think we're maybe a little bit faster than this car in front. It's kind of tricky, not enough to just blow by them when we get a chance, but just to buy a little bit. If I can set that up right. The next car is Tebow. Car. On your left. I was trying to kind of Still set there. that up right and didn't really get there. Still there. Still there. Clear left. Yellow flag, keep your wits about you, mate. Clear. Car right. Keep it clean. Hold your line. Keep it clean. What Clear right. Fuck? V12. I'll keep it clean. to Nice. Ahead is increasing. It's now 0.9. The next car is Nice. Car number 18. P11. They're not gonna. They're not gonna be happy with that guy. I have a feeling that guy's gonna get taken out at some point. Dang it, I'm gonna know if there's Left a spot, side. just because that guy was able to get through there better. Hold your line. Oh, Hold your line. Hold your line. Still there. Hold your line. Still there. Hold your line. Still there. Clear left. B9. Got, uh, didn't, got, didn't lose that spot. We did a good job of giving them space. The, those two are fighting for it. Shit, messed that up. Sorry, excuse my language. 
I was looking in my rearview mirror too much there. Okay, Ryan, that's half distance. You're looking good for fuel. Time to get defensive, mate. Car right. Clear right. Just straight send it in, man. Okay, stay with him. On your right. Still there. Clear right. Guy in front is point net, car number two, D license. You just straight chucked it up in there, man. Ah, that was bad. We don't want to hit that first apex. position. Yeah, that green car is the number two, so he was going to chuck it up in there anyway. He's probably frustrated because it's taking him a while to get through the field. If we can get a few solid laps, I think we can get away from that yellow car. I think we're a little faster than them. We got that car that spun out kind of got us hung up and he let him close up on us. There we go, we got through there pretty good. Daniel, come on, let me there. That's your fastest lap today. That's good. Took the heck of a time to get our fastest lap. Okay, Ryan. Five minutes to go. Five minutes left. This is the part that I can mess up the most and really let somebody get back into it. He's a little bit better than me through there. I just have to try to minimize damage. Keep your concentration. Make the bastard work for it. I think we're a little bit better through there, but then we kind of give it back right here. I really need to start getting through here super clean. That was not good.
trying to throw it up in there again. Get a little defensive here. Ah! Luckily, he's kind of bad there, too. Two minutes to go, two minutes. He's trying to get on the inside of me. So far he's racing me clean, but he's getting really close. I don't know if he's racing me clean or if he's just not close enough to really get me. Yellow flag. Not sure who brought out the yellow. Do a little defensive line here. Ooh, we got through there real good. That was good. Look at the ground we made up on or put up on them. Picked the right time to do that. Good. White flag. I think he's got he's battling back there. White flag, one more lap. That lap was at 103.21. Good race, well played. All right, top ten. I'm pretty happy with that. Most of the other races I've done, I just am in the back of the pack, and I just have to wait for people to wreck. But we actually kind of did a little race in there, had a little pace. Yellow flag, watch out. Tenth position. Okay, that's the end. Good finish, mate. Well done. Yeah, you wanted a, he wanted a P12. We went out and got a 10. How about that? Go ahead and get some extra safety rating by doing the cooldown lap. Fun fact, if you... You can get it some extra safety rating by doing your cooldown lap. But you can also lose it, so don't spin out. If you can't get through the lap cleanly, don't don't do it.
All right, that was fun. Good deal. So there you have it, uh, top 10 uh, here at Lime Rock in the GR86 with the Tom's Supra livery that I like. Uh, that was fun. That was good. I th I th that felt pretty good. You know, I felt like we had a little bit of pace. Obviously, we weren't in the quickest, but we were able to hold some people off. We did some defensive maneuvers. We ran good in traffic. Like, we were able to kind of stay within people, but that was, that was a good time. Um, like and subscribe. Like I said, Kansas coming up this week. Uh, I plan to do that and get that track. Um, Use the donation link in the comments if you want to just, you know, send me some money to get these tracks so um, we could do every race. Like I said, I didn't really have money for Bristol. Things are a little tight right now. Kind of looking for a new job, but we'll see. Um, but thanks for tuning in. Like and subscribe. I appreciate it, and I will see you guys on the next one.